Welcome or welcome back to my channel and happy vlogmas day 15 as you can tell we didn't make it to two jack lake this morning for sunrise But we're hoping to do it soon. We just didn't get up like early enough and we wanted to kind of have a slower morning once we got up So yeah, that's what we basically did so subscribe if you want to catch that and the rest of our Banff adventures But we're still gonna have a fun day in Banff. We're going there for the first time today yesterday We just spent our time in Canmore So we had some breakfast this morning and got ready. We're gonna head to the Banff gondola this morning. It's still early. It's like 9 a.m. And also today is like probably a guaranteed clear day and we want to make sure we can like see everything from up there. So I'm super excited for the views and to go to Banff for the first time. So yeah, let's let's go. And then oh also we're going to the Banff Christmas market this afternoon. So that will be a whole lot of festive fun. I am so excited for that. That view after the garage opened, wow, <laughs> off we go. gondola now and we're about to hop on. I'm very excited. <laughs> Thank you. 
crazy, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do to stay warm. Anthony's doing a lot of good shooting. My battery's about to die, because it's probably so cold. The view is gorgeous. Oh my goodness, I like every single turn. I just say, oh my gosh, every time. What's the elevation? His watch says 7,500 feet. I'm just, I'm obsessed, I'll show you. I'm cold. Hopefully the audio is not so bad. I'm kind of behind a wall, so the wind is probably not in the shot as much. I did bring my mic, but I haven't had a chance to take it out. I keep turning off the camera because it like kind of <laughs> extends the battery, but yeah, I bet you it's gonna shut off. I should change it. We're at the weather station too. Oh. That's interesting. Come down here. Let's go. This is the view on this side though. Yeah. Holy crap. Stove. We just added the mic to the top. I don't know if the audio is better. Here's hoping it is. I'm just stepping down so I don't like fall. This is the weather tower, right? And you can see inside of it. So sort of. stove in there. Whoa, can we go in and warm up? Or like Maybe someone used to stay in here. The stove is right there on the right. I don't know if you can see it. No, it's hard to see. <laughs> building my camera kind of like freaked out the screen went green right in the middle of the shot so we put it away warmed it up old for a while and now we're in like the main building so I just cute little Christmas tree we just had some snacks with a view and we're gonna go explore I don't know where Anthony went there's some fun facts and info to look at here I don't know where he went there he is Hey. Okay. Look, we have the people having a nice little campsite. <laughs> nice bum, where are you from? Christmas Day. Cool. They've got a little snow globe. down from the parking lot to all the way up here. I saw this and the only thing I could think of was Cosmic Rays, Starlight Cafe. Here we go! When there's a smile in your heart, <laughs> there's a better time to start. I just noticed how coordinated he looks. Like hat matches, pants, gloves match, the like, jacket, and then what he was saying, his backpack matches his pants. His pants and boots and hat. I guess this is the perfect place to update you. I mean, we're chilling on the gondola. We are heading down. We are gonna head to the Banff Christmas Market. I think this is the last weekend of it, unfortunately. So if you're watching this thinking, oh, I wanna go, sorry. I've already been to one Christmas market this year, the Distillery District in Toronto's Christmas Winter Village. And it was so cute. That was like my first Christmas market. So I'm excited for my second in this beautiful place. I can't wait for the festive vibes. Enjoying the view until we get there. And we're back. They even take your photo on the way out and it's up there. I can't take a photo of it. Very cute. And then of course, just like Disney, you end up in a gift shop. to the town or like just the Christmas market. But surprise, we changed our minds. We are at Surprise Corner Viewpoint. Anthony's idea as we were like driving, he's like, oh, maybe we could do this. So this is very close to town, off Tunnel Mountain Drive. See, everything is super close. Hi. 
see the view at Surprise Viewpoint or whatever it's called. We came around to the Fairmont Banff Springs instead to take a closer look. There she is. <laughs> See it gushing up there just a tad in the right corner of it but otherwise it's just like coming out of nowhere underneath <laughs> Get a good view, that's where we were apparently at the, uh, surprise, surprise that corner, corner that's the word I was missing before I guess without the Sun in our eyes we could have seen the falls from up there maybe, and the hotel I don't know, better the might not maybe not so, yeah it's far down there it is this is thinking of you caroling, some mulled wine, hot chocolate, other alcoholic beverages, and also like some hot plate stuff. There's like pierogies. It's mostly like the little vendors in the tent and in the stables, and of course, Santa Claus. But because this is gonna be over by the time I post this video, there are sleigh rides, which we unfortunately will miss out on. But if you're looking to go on a really cute sleigh ride, this is where you can do it, so. But yeah, that was the Banff Christmas Market. Park 
parked on Bow Avenue. It looks like there's free parking, nine hour limit, obviously between certain times. So if you wanna avoid paid parking, that's the way to go. And we're heading to Three Bears Brewing Company? Brewing restaurant? Okay, I'll figure out the name in a second, but we're gonna grab some dinner. restaurant was delicious they have a lot of like unique food items like I had elk sausage on my pizza and it was amazing and like delicious other ingredients like topped on there and the dough was super unique I don't know what exactly it was it was like a fermentation process like takes like 72 hours or something so it was delicious I need to cross the street I'm gonna get and now we're heading to the car to make sure there's enough room before we pick up our skis and snowboard or are you gonna get ski tomorrow maybe ski okay we're doing two days, like I said in the other video. He'll definitely snowboard at some point because he is definitely a snowboarder. He likes to snowboard a lot. a lot. More. I've only skied like, I don't know, five to ten times. I mean, same, so. But I've snowboarded <laughs> like, I don't know, over a hundred probably, so. We're gonna pick him up in town a little bit cheaper that way and then head to the hotel and potentially go in the pool. We'll see. <laughs> we did so much today and it was only our first day in Banff but oh my goodness it is so beautiful I mean the mountains in Canmore I mean also gorgeous but those views on the Banff gondola oh my god it was a little bit spenny a little bit expensive but I think it was it was worth it like it was so cool and then the Christmas market was really cute a little bit small I will say that the distillery district was definitely bigger but it was very cute especially with the mountains all around oh my god uh, we did a lot today tomorrow is a ski day so subscribe if you haven't already oh also I I did dip into the pool like very briefly we went into the sauna but it's kind of awkward because there's a lot of people and I wasn't about to film with people around and like where would I put my camera it's like frozen cold outside I'll try and get some footage of it in the next coming days subscribe for the rest of our Banff adventures I hope you liked the video and if you did please don't forget to give it a like and I appreciate you watching this video I'll see you tomorrow bye <laughs>